Now, incredible new images off the Florida coast capture last weekend's failed sea barge landing of SpaceX's Falcon 9 rocket. The company's founder tweeted the photos today of what uh, some he called humorously a RUD, a rapid unscheduled disassembly. The unmanned rocket's four stabilizing fins lost hydraulic fluid just before landing. It was returning from a resupply mission to the International Space Station. Now, the billionaire space pioneer behind that rocket brought another rocket ship to Seattle. And there is more from Elon Musk. He is establishing a new engineering outpost in Redmond. Camera 7's Essex Porter is live with why Musk is here and why the governor is now asking him for help. Essex? <laughs> And the first thing we want to do is give you a look at the spaceship that Elon Musk brought to town. He has it under a tent here at Seattle Center. It is for a private event that he is having here at Seattle Center tonight. His guests will be able to enjoy it for the evening, but he's leaving something far more permanent behind. Now on the east side, there's an office building where the windows are covered in plastic. But public records we checked told us this is Elon Musk's SpaceX outpost in Redmond. The only sign on the property says no trespassing, so we were not able to see if Musk made an expected visit to new employees. SpaceX is based in Los Angeles, so why set up an office all the way up here in Redmond? Well, Elon Musk told reporters this is a good place to poach engineers from Microsoft and Boeing. And lift off of the SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket with Dragon. Eventually, upwards of a thousand engineers will design satellites that could support a trip to Mars. Governor Inslee is thrilled Musk chose Washington. Because it recognizes that our real strength in the state of Washington is intellectual talent. SpaceX currently makes reusable capsules that supply the International Space Station. We found the first one to complete the trip being set up at Seattle Center, where it will be featured at a private event Musk is holding tonight. But solar panels were on the governor's mind as he planned to speak with Musk before the event, because Inslee wants more people to use clean solar energy. He's been involved in a company that has done leasing, and we, we need to find a solution. SpaceX is here for the long haul. That capsule that they are displaying tonight here at Seattle Center, it's moving to the Museum of Flight overnight, and it'll be on display for the public through the weekend. Reporting live in Seattle, Essex, Porter Cairo 7, Eyewitness News.